it's Lily. So today I'm going to be doing maybe the last braces update. What? That's like crazy saying that because honestly it feels like I just got my braces on. I remember the very first day I got my braces on. I remember vlogging that footage and R.I.P. R.I.P. braces. Pretty much I will be getting my braces off in six weeks. So I think I'm getting them off on March 20 something. But yeah, I'm really excited but also kind of sad because I know you love these types of videos and I know you guys have loved watching my braces journey and they're my most viewed videos and so I'm gonna be kind of sad but I'll still do like teeth updates and like every time I go into the orthodontist like I think you have to go in every like six months or something um and then I'll like just do like a teeth update then I don't really know but yeah so I just went to the orthodontist yesterday which was February 9th today's February 10th so yeah, basically what they did was they just put on new power chains and they took off rubber bands in the back or the power chain in the very, very back. I only had it on for one time. They only put it on for one time. I got pink because Valentine's Day is coming up, so I thought it was appropriate to have pink and also it's pretty... So yeah, I've just been getting a lot of requests like in my l other update videos to do like a more detailed like close up of my braces and like a more in depth and like um, my inside of my mouth. So I've never taken those types of pictures. I'm really sorry about that. I didn't know you guys wanted that. Like a couple people asked me to like see like how the roof of my mouth changed. Because I told you guys in like my very, very first one that like my mouth used to be kind of like a V-shaped and then they curved it to make it like a U-shape. Not like my mouth, but like my teeth. I think I'm just going to show you guys the update and yeah. Okay, so here's what they look like right now. So as you can see, they don't have the power chains on the very back. Right there. Yeah, I don't really have any gaps anymore. I mean, this one is a little tiny gap, but it will probably close in six weeks, like fully close. My bottom teeth really hurt for some reason. I don't know why. This tooth right here, it's this one really hurts. I don't know what they're doing to it or if they're moving it. I don't really know what's happening. I just want to kind of show you, like, I feel like you guys really don't know what exactly the things are in my mouth so before I get them off I want to just definitely go in detail and show you exactly what I mean by when I say brackets or rubber bands or whatever okay so these things are right here those are brackets um, all the metal like this metal part is a bracket so it's flat underneath my tooth so they just put glue on that and it stays there like that this is a power chain so all the pink stuff is a power chain so this basically just pulls my teeth together better than just regular rubber bands so regular rubber bands would just be going around this so as you can tell that the power chain goes like that around the bracket but um just a regular rubber band would just go around like a square like that there's a wire underneath, I don't know if you can see, there's a wire underneath the power chain here, you can see it here. That is the wire, right there, and there's different sizes, I don't know what size this is. This thing right here is a hook for rubber bands, I never got rubber bands, rubber bands are like legit rubber bands, you connect them to this hook and I guess this hook, and they really just help with um, correcting like a bite so like if you have a, an overbite or an underbite they help but I didn't need that um this is a molar band that is a molar band I can see it better here oh wait I don't have a molar band here I forgot yeah so it goes all around this tooth as you can tell it's pokey right here <laughs> It's 
what it looks like. And basically, it gives a place for the wire to go. So you, they stuck the wire right here and right here. And I'm not sure what these little hole loop thingies are. I don't really know. They just seem like extra metal in my mouth. Um, and then they just put the rubber band around this little part right here. Whatever that is. It's like on my gum. I don't really know what that is, but it's just part of the molar band. I don't have a molar band on my bottom braces. I have no idea why. I just have one, and they put another bracket, a really weird bracket. I have no idea what this bracket's called, on the very, very back of my teeth. Right there, as you can tell. I don't know what it is. I don't know. I don't think it's a bracket. I think it's like half of the molar band so they can just put the wire on. I guess I'm not really sure. So yeah, I think I pretty much explained everything. So if you followed me for a really long time, I used to have these like arch thingies. I have no idea what they're called. I have no they were for my spaces. My space right here. But yeah, so here is a detailed look. They look very yellow. But I'm going to whiten them when I get my braces off. Oh, the upper part of my mouth. So, as you can tell, it's perfect. <laughs> like, honestly, it is. It's nice and shaped right. That's shaped right. It used to be, I guess, like, pointed, I guess. I really don't know. So that's what it looks like. So I'm glad I did that. I'm glad I did a close-up of my teeth and all that stuff for you guys. Before I get them off, I'm not quite sure if I'm going to do, like, another update. Um, I know I'm going in four weeks just to make sure that everything's all right and that I can get them off, which will be March 8th or something like that. I don't know. Um, but I will get a checkup and then I will get them off. It takes about an hour and a half to get them off. I'm going to try to vlog that day, like just exactly like I did. The very first day I vlogged uh, my braces experience, I want to vlog get, getting them off. I'm going to try to like bring my camera or my phone into the office. They usually don't really care if I have like my phone out or whatever. So if you guys have any more questions, please leave them down below because when I do get my braces off, I will be doing like a Q&A slash like my experience. So yeah, I'm really excited. Before I go, I just want to say one thing. This is kind of random, but if you guys didn't know, like I love Maddie Bragg so much. This is very random. Um, she is my favorite YouTuber of all time. I don't know. There's just something about her that like makes me feel very connected to her and like she's the reason why I got my hair dyed this color and I don't know there's just something about her that I just love but I remember one night I think it was in my old house and it was that time of the month and I was having really really bad cramps and I woke up and I remember she posted her uh, braces experience like the moment I went on YouTube that night and I just remember watching it and I was like, oh my gosh, I can't wait until like I can be like her. Because I don't know, I just really like that video. And something about that video like clicked to me. I don't really know. That was really random. But yeah, so I want to do kind of a video like that. I will link that video down below if you want to go check that video out. Yeah, I will put in a slideshow right now of my whole braces experience. <laughs>
next video. Please subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And definitely leave comments down below of questions or just comments or anything or suggestions on videos. or I don't care. I love you guys so much and I'll see you next week. Bye!